I was the best. <laughs> you know, I'm having a lot of fun this morning, man. Just embracing life itself. You know, just uh, just kind of just having fun. You know, I just uh, I love this life so much. I think I'm really, really grateful. Extremely grateful. You know, like I was saying earlier in my other page. You know. I got a, someone shoot me a text yesterday and, you know, inbox me actually, you know, and uh, accusing me of uh, having a page that I don't know nothing about and I, I thought that was really funny because when it comes to this running thing, I don't need to be in nobody's group <laughs> when it comes to running. I do not need to be in anybody's group. You know, I have been doing this for years. It's a lifestyle. I spent 15 years, the last 15 years, running, healing, getting injured, going through stuff just by running. So I don't need to be in no group. No group at all. <laughs> so if I'm posting in your, if I'm posting in your group, you better respect me and be grateful. Because it's a lot of hard work. Uh, <laughs> how you doing, brother? I'm okay. Have a great day. <laughs> it is a lot of hard work. You know, this is not something that I just do because I'm not trying to get in shape. It's beyond that. <laughs> you know, you can't do this trying to get in shape. You know, so this is just like a platform for me to express myself just like everyone else. You know, so if I'm posting on your page, and I could say this because it's the one problem that I have with a lot of people that don't eat the same way I do. And I can say that right now. You know, I, I, I really think because of the way my diet is and when I'm putting things into this group, I just see it, it, it's funny, you know, because, uh, and that's why food is so important. You know, the stuff that we put in our system is very important because it derives us, you know, it makes us think a certain way, even though we don't realize it. Now I'm looking to my left right here. I like that beautiful cloud. <laughs> yeah, I like that beautiful cloud. And like I always say to people, I'm able to do this because of the way I eat. Period. There's two things to it. Yoga and not eating animal products. <laughs> it's just no way around it. You know, it's two things to me being able to, I could, you know, put a lot of miles on my body like this. Is yoga, meditation and not eating animals. That's just it. Period. Yeah. It's a beautiful day today. You know, so I'm just kind of just tracking along. You know, just running my mouth, and you know, when I see people, I might stop and say hello. So today, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to stay as long on my feet as I can today. You know, it's an easy, easy 13 miles. You know, I want, I want to do this thing and feel like I didn't even do nothing today. You know, and that's the whole thing with taking your time. Because when you don't take your time, you cannot do this. Oh, look at this river right here. Let me point the camera to it. As you can see, I, I truly have fun doing this thing. That's the camera right there in nature. The road is actually getting busy today. You know, there's a lot of cars out. You know, so... And as you can see, it's just amazing, nature, you know, everything is just stunning green or blue or whatever it is. <laughs> yeah. So it's just sort of, I'm just having fun with it and just, you know, putting things in my own perspective and how I want to feel in my head. What do I want to think about? 
you know, what is so important? What would be good for my health to be thinking about right now? What are the things that alters my emotions? You know, those are the things that I think about in this room. You know, why am I doing this? You know, uh, why does it come so natural? You know, so, you know, it makes me want to do different things, read, study different things. And uh, this whole thing made me realize I know nothing. So because of it, I'm able to slow down and arrogancy disappears because if I want to do this every day, I have to have slow days to where I just move my body accordingly. And that's what I do. <laughs> Even though I'm jogging, I'm out running today, I'm actually taking a day off. <laughs> this is a day off for me. Because I'm just moving so slow, it's amazing. Oh yeah. <laughs> that beautiful thing. You know, as you can see, there's cars everywhere too. <laughs> so I'm moving so slow that today is actually a day off. Even though I'm going to have to jog like 30 miles. <laughs> so it's my day off today. So I'm just moving my feet. <laughs> so that's just the way it is, you know. When you learn that, and that slowing down comes from years of meditation. And quieting them. Oh my goodness, look at that beautiful sky. To my right hand side right here. The road is really, really clear this morning. Yeah, my goodness. Yeah, this is definitely history right here. And whatever it is that is making us move or move our body, we got to be grateful for it. You know, we got to be grateful for all those things. And I definitely, I am. <laughs> I definitely, I am grateful. And to all my fellow vegans, brothers and sisters, I have never said this before, but God, damn, I love you all, man. Because it's funny, there's something about being vegan that just makes people connect. I have gotten along so well with people who are vegan that don't look like me, <laughs> don't come from my ethnicity background, and you just blew me the biscuit away. You know, how I've gotten, uh, it's almost like, oh yeah, this is my diet, boom. It's amazing to me. So to that, to all the vegans out there, big up respect. I love the way the community has come together. You know, we have come together, not in a radical manner, but in, I, I, I've been vegan for over 10 years now, well, almost 12, 13, and I begin to truly understand the true meaning of it. Because once you respect a certain species, you are able to respect every other human being. And that's just what I've learned. Once you are able to respect certain species, you are able to respect every other human beings. And I have never had any problem with, you know, a vegan group. You know, there's just never been a problem. This is not a competition. It's a, I don't know what it is when people, <laughs> yeah, a lot of the people that are, you know, let me just keep quiet. I'm not going to say nothing, but that's what I'm just saying to all the fellow vegans. I think... Eating this way has allowed me to reach out to people who don't look like me, who is not from my ethnicity background, but because we put the same thing in our stomach, we can see eye to eye. And that really just blew me the biscuit away. <laughs> and I'm grateful for that. You know, so <laughs> these are the things right there. So yes, yes. So let's continue to spread love among one another. And I'm learning the hard way. You know, every day is still a learning process. But yeah, I get it. I see why people want to eat a certain way. And it never failed me. I just never had 
Oh, I love this beautiful, beautiful thing right here. There is just something about <laughs> when, uh, when we, I, let me just keep quiet. When people say they're vegan, there's just something about it. it it's almost like their whole thinking changes, you know, and their treatment of somebody who doesn't look like them or from their cultural background changes. It is amazing. And I think it's something that we need to talk about more. And I can say this, being an African descent, and I see it a lot that it makes me question, why is it that somebody that doesn't look like me speaks my language? Why do we get along when all I have to say is, yeah, let's go and get uh, a veggie burger. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Just going out to get a veggie burger. <laughs> Make sure you communicate with someone. I just think, hey, yeah, I'm learning the hard way, but yeah, I think I need to wake up <laughs> and stop acting the biscuit and know that it's not intentional, but I get it now. You know, all my vegan friends have been telling me for years, I get it, I get the picture. Yeah, I'm naive. <laughs> so I'm going to leave it like that. You yeah. know, this is not a. Uh, exercise for me it's just a way to build energy you know I'm just building that energy and yeah the food that you eat does make you. so I'm gonna say one love to every single person that has shown so much love to those animals because it allows them also to show that same love to me and not judge me from my race or from the ethnicity that I came from or from my spiritual belief. I gotta say that whole vegan thing, big of respect to that. And I'm gonna say one love and I get it. I share. <laughs>